guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Marlene. Welcome to my channel, bitch. Do not forget to hit the subscribe button and the bell right next to it so you get notified every time I upload a brand new video. A brand new video. A brand new video. Oh my god, you guys. I am gonna be getting surgery again. And I'm actually gonna be getting it today. I'm just waiting for Oscar to pick me up and I'm so like excited a little bit nervous because obviously it's normal to be a little bit nervous but let me go ahead and let you guys know what i'm getting done which i never really talked about but it was just always in the back of my head um to do and one day i was just like girl i'm just gonna do it like there marlene just do it you've been wanting to do it it's something that you don't like so i am gonna be getting chin lipo you guys are probably like marlene you don't have anything what the fuck are you gonna get out but in reality like and pictures and like videos there's an angle that i don't like and i can never never get rid of it and i'm gonna go ahead and try and look for pictures um to show you guys later on in this video of how it looks even in mexico dude when i was over there i kept like they kept taking pictures of me or videos and there was a video that my boyfriend took and i was like this is why i'm getting the surgery and he's like oh my god babe but i was like no like you can straight up tell and I actually have the footage of that. I'm gonna look for it and sh screenshot that part. <laughs> second and yeah i have my appointment at 12 the doctor did tell me that it's a very easy procedure it's a 20 minute procedure actually so i'm gonna be in and out i should be leaving like around uh 10 45 it is in beverly hills with dr das i'll give you guys more information once i get there but i am supposed to be eating something right now because they did tell me no makeup um eat a light meal before and also no jewelry so i did go ahead and take it off the only thing is that i'm struggling to take this one off dude and i'm gonna have to tell them because it's like those screwy ones and i have nails girl if you guys are interested in watching this whole process then please keep on watching so as you guys know today is dia de los muertos and my mom bought a pan de muertos Dude, this bun is so good. And she also made some chocolate over here. But she's so cute, dude. She put an ofrenda for my abuelitos. And um, for everybody that we don't have today. She put, obviously, some flowers. And then las veladoras. So I'm going to eat some of that right now. Um, they said something light. So I'm probably just going to eat a pedazo de pan with, like, some chocolate. Um, but yeah, guys. Oh, my God. It's starting to hit me. Like, I don't know. It was so fast. You see what I mean? Look. Ya viene en camino. Tiene que estar aquí a las 10.45. Nada más con pan y chocolate, ¿crees que estoy bien? Pues me dijeron algo light. Sí, ¿no? You guys, Prince keeps going over there because he smells the pan. Look at him. Friends, <laughs> I'm getting a little bit nervous, but I'm trying to remind myself that everything's gonna be okay. No negative thoughts here. No negative thoughts here. Okay, guys, so Scoop picked me up already. We love a supportive boyfriend. Ah! <laughs> oh, it's actually 38 minutes now. Oh, nice. That's not bad. How do you feel, babe, that I'm getting my chin lipo done? Mm, I feel whatever you feel. So you feel a little bit nervous because I'm a little bit nervous? Mm, nah, I never get nervous. Oh, sh I'm a little nervous, babe. I'm not going to lie to you. Don't be. Yeah, that's going to help me not be nervous. <laughs> <laughs>
Alright guys, we finally made it. Ah, it's currently 12.03, so... Right here. Is it all cold? Dude, it's cold. What the hell? And I'm nervous. It's like No, it's not this one. It's 420. Oh, yeah, so we have to go up. Okay, ask why they're asking for information. Okay. Oh. You're gonna go in too. Ah. I guess I can put a driver as my resume. I should put on um, <laughs> husband. Just have a seat. The nurse is going to come in. She's going to start by taking us a couple of photos. And okay. then uh, the doctor will come see you. Okay, okay? perfect. Thank mm -hmm. you. Okay. <sighs> I'm Alrighty. We'll just wait now. Okay. Cheers. I came out with my maletita. Dr. Des. Oh yeah, so did I tell you guys? Oh, I did tell you guys what I was getting done. Se me va la onda. It's because I was like, wait, did I tell you? But yeah, I did. I told them about when we went to Mexico and you had taken a video or a picture of me and you were able to tell. And I was like, babe, this is why I want to get it done. And then he was like, I babe. I, I recorded you and I showed you the picture. I'm showing you the picture and like you can see your reaction or your face. Like, yeah, I have the. Yeah, like you were clipping that. I I have the the clip. I might. I think I'm gonna put it in here so you guys are able to see. But I was like, I was just like, this is exactly why. Like it was just confirmation that I was like, okay, yeah, I want to go through with it. So here we are, waiting for Doctor Das. I think they gave me one. A pill to relax because I'm a little nervous, but it's all good. I'll chill. You don't think they have pills for me? Ah. <laughs> for what? You're nervous too? No. Cutie. I just want pills. Ah, You're imagine. nervous. <laughs> You're nervous too? No. I should probably not be nervous. I don't make him nervous. Mm. Oh, you're like, I know. It's going to be quick, baby. Like 15 minutes, she said. This is the quickest yeah, surgery know. there is. Honestly. Imagine, babe, if you would have been, like, if you would have met me when um, I did my BBL. Uh -huh. You probably would have been super nervous. Because uh -huh. that's three hours uh -huh. that I was in there. <laughs> 
Okay guys, so we're here with Dr. Das and he's going to be doing my chin light bulb and he's going to explain a little bit more of what he's going to do to me. Yeah, hi, I'm Dr. Dennis Das. I'm a board certified plastic surgeon in Beverly Hills and today we're going to do a mini neck lift. And what this is, is a uh, liposuction of the chin, okay, to get rid of this stubborn little fat here that sometimes creates a double chin or just makes things look not quite as nice or maybe more aged. So I'm going to remove that through liposuction and internally I'm going to use a laser to tighten the skin. And what that's going to do is it's going to help the skin stick up nicely and give a really nice contoured look. So that way the neck and chin line looks snatched. It's going to look really defined and it looks really beautiful. The great thing about this procedure is it, it's really quick. It's done under local anesthesia and it takes about 20 minutes and it's painless. Um, I do, I give you uh, medicine to make you comfortable and it kind of takes the edge off. Uh, and then I put in a lot of local anesthetic through this area and that doesn't hurt. It just feels weird when I do that. And then I can do the entire procedure painless. And the recovery is rather quick as well. Okay, so you're going to be wearing a chin strap to help the swelling go down, help the skin stick up and heal nicely. And you're going to be wearing that for about two weeks. The first week all the time, second week just when you're not in public. And then you're done. And then you're going to have a great jawline that looks amazing in pictures. You're going to love Very it. snatched. <laughs> <laughs> I'm excited. Thank you, doctor. Of course. Oscar is not nervous anymore. He said the doctor made him feel comfortable. Never nervous, leaves. <sighs> now we're here. About to go in in a bit. Now, uh, yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I should do a few shots. Mm, sit down. It was so easy, you guys. No, it literally was so easy. Like, how long was I in there for? Mm, I didn't even finish watching my YouTube video. I was like 10 minutes in. And you started it when I was in there? Mm, kind of. Oh, your mom oh. called actually. You were in there for like 20 minutes. Should we call your mom? Now we something. leave. Let's go. We have to pick up some medicine, but oh my god, you guys, I'm all done. Mm -hmm. Perfect. We're good to go already? We're good to go. Let's 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 go. When Marlene Dizzle walks on the street, and that's how we got traffic. When I mean, you don't give two fucks because no one knows you here. So I'm officially in the car. Good afternoon, Oscar Aguayo. Hello, Mercedes. How are you? Great. Thanks. Are you done, Mercedes? Thank you. I don't know if you guys are going to understand me, but because I'm numb right now, but... I didn't feel pain at all. It was just a weird feeling because I'm awake. But they did cover my eyes with like a thingy. So I couldn't see anything. I was just like laying back. They injected me something first. Which was I think a little bit of anesthesia. So that when they did inject the whole anesthesia in. It wouldn't hurt as much. It did feel like a burning sensation. When they did go in with the anesthesia. And then... That was it. Then after that, I could feel everything go numb. They waited like a couple minutes, and then that's when they went in with the laser. And I heard like popping sensation because the fat was melting. So it was just popping sensation and a little bit of movement. And then when they were taking off my fat that was melted, that's when I did feel a lot of movement. It didn't hurt. But I did feel like they were going in. And you hear like the fat coming out of you. Like, like kind of like little flips. And then that took like probably like 5-10 minutes. And then after that, bitch, I was done. So literally the whole procedure was like 20 minutes. And then he played Lana Del Rey for me, dude. How cool was that? So I was listening to Kiss me hard before you go. Summertime sadness. Overall, guys, didn't feel pain at all. Only when they put the anesthesia was a little bit burning sensation, but nothing like out of like the blue. And now 
we just wait for the results. Literally, when he was going in, guys, I could feel how snatched I was getting. Because he was, like, on my jawline. And I was like, whoa. He did put this garment on me. I'm supposed to be wearing this for two weeks, one week, day and night. And the next week, uh, I could take it off when I go up. How did you feel when you were waiting for me? Mm. <laughs> like it was another day. I have... I knew everything was going to be good. I need to call my mom. Actually, let me call my mom with you guys. So you guys can see her reaction. Hi, madre. Oh, my goodness. Parece ñoño. Wow. Ya. ¿Cómo te sientes? Bien. Bien. ¿Te dolió? No, pero se sintió raro. Thank you, God, porque everything is fine. Uh -huh. ¿Mm? Thank you, Grandma. Dile Thank a tu you, abuelita. Grandma. Thank you, tío. What do you guys think about my team? What do you think? I think it looks funny. Mm -hmm. What do you think? Funny, mommy, pero no comas mucho. <laughs> My mom made me some caldo de pollo and then some verdura here. We have, thank you, mommy. Siempre ayudándome en mis cirugías. <laughs> we love a supportive mom, a supportive dad, and a supportive boyfriend. Sí, sí, sí. True. ¿Cómo me ves? It's currently 12 midnight. Actually, no, it's 1 a.m. And I took a nap earlier, like around 10 p.m. And you're not supposed to sleep with almohadas. So I took them off. But, dude, when I woke up, well, actually, no, I didn't start hurting until now. So I took like half of the painkillers that they gave me because. They told me that those painkillers are super, super strong. So I just took half of it. And if I do feel more pain, then I'm going to take another half. But I don't think I need to. I think right now I'm just going to lay down and go to sleep again if I can. But I have some snacks because I took a painkiller pill. So I'm trying to eat some little snacks and then water. So I don't like drink it on an empty stomach. I'm here with my waves. He's a sleepy head. He likes going to sleep with me on FaceTime. Anyways, y'all, I'm gonna go ahead and try to sleep it off and just try to sleep as comfortable as I can. And then I'll update you guys tomorrow morning. Good night. The next day. Good morning, you guys. Oh my God, I look a mess. I slept pretty good. The only thing it was a little bit uncomfortable to sleep like boca abajo and like without a almohada um prince kept me company huh princey oh my goodness my love all right now i want to shower because i feel disgusting and my hair feels disgusting so i don't think i'm gonna wash my hair i think i'm just gonna i'm scared to take off my band but i think i'm gonna have to take it off to like fix this going on here because girl and then i'm gonna start working because i have some stuff to edit um i have the mexico vlog to edit for you guys and then i have other stuff to work on grind don't stop i still gotta edit mamas i still gotta work mamas you guys oscar picked me up because he's gonna take care of me and he brought me starbucks dude he brought me the almond the christmas you know how i was obsessed with the I sugar grande almond, I don't know what. He got me some with sprinkles. And then he got me a cake pop. Thank you, baby. We got some Olive Garden going on here. I'm so excited. I love Olive Garden guys. I love the Alfredo chicken Alfredo. It's currently day two. I was gonna say day three, but no, it's day two. I still have this little fajita on. And I am currently Y'all wanna know what I'm doing? Watching a Bad Bunny video, but I should really be doing this. I'm editing my YouTube video because it goes up today, it's Friday. 
And I wanted to go up today, but I'm almost done. I just need to take some part out and edit some part out. But my neck definitely hurts because I have to be like this. Still haven't taken this off to see it, but I also did stop taking my pain medication because it doesn't hurt how it hurt yesterday. I'll update you guys tomorrow or maybe when I take this off so you guys can see how it looks. It's probably going to be swollen, so... I'm already like preparing myself just so I'm not too hard on myself and I'm like, oh my god, like, you know, it's going to be swollen. It is like, at the end of the day. So I'll update you guys when I take this off. I'm going to be taking a shower right now. It's currently day three, but I want to shower my head and my hair. I feel itchy and I think it's because I haven't showered my hair. I've been showering just my butt. Excuse me. I've been showering just my body. And I also am supposed to be applying an Arnica Bruise Gel and some Neosporin, so for the scarring. But I'm going to take this off right now to start showering. And I'm scared because it's the first time I'm going to be taking it off. So with that being said, actually let me just put this up in a bun. I hate doing these things dude with like my BBL. I hate it, like, having to shower and taking on my faja, like, it's just, like, weird, but let me do, oh, I'm scared, I'm scared, I'm scared, I'm scared, I'm still in child life. Okay, like you guys can see. Oh my god, can you guys see that? I'm still in Chada. What does it feel like it say something? Oh my god, imagine. You can already tell. It's still a lot swollen, so I'm pretty sure it's gonna go down. I'm shook. Okay, I need to shower quick because girl. I just need to shower. I'll be right back. Okay, guys, so I'm out of the shower and I feel so much better. Like, you guys do not understand how good this shit feels. But, okay, now I'm going to be putting on the Arnica gel on my neck. And the Oscar's currently buying me, like, a, another band-aid because I feel like I have to take this band-aid off so that I can put the nail spray. Oh, my God. Oh, feels like weird. All right, guys. So I already went ahead, applied everything. Now um, I'm just waiting for my boyfriend to bring me like a new pad because I want to wear like one of these new pads. And I'm gonna be putting this back on soon. And so far, so good. You guys, Oscar always does this. I tell him literally two things, and he brings me like seven. Ooh, he's like just making sure I'm like, but when am I gonna use this, honey? Well, maybe for future surgeries. Ah, uh, right. I'm like, I'm not kidding, guys. Right Hold it up here. Good. Hold that. This one. Okay, I'm all done, I put it back on, it feels tight, it's supposed to be compressed, and yay, I feel clean again, finally, I'll keep updating you guys, um, on Monday I do have a checkup um, appointment with the doctor, 
and I'll let you guys know how it goes. I'll take you guys with me so you guys come along too, but this is it for now. So I came to my follow-up appointment and we'll see how it goes. I'm going to put my phone here because I forgot my... I forgot my camera. Like I always do. Who would imagine they have on cameras? Yeah, Alright, so I am going to just take a look, okay? Okay. So you can go ahead and take your um, garment off. Okay. And I'll just take a look. Are you still taking your pain medication? Yeah. yeah. Um, actually, no, I stopped yesterday. Okay. Um, I was really just good. taking it whenever I would feel the pain. Okay. But um, I would just get it like, it would come and go, so I, yeah. didn't, I didn't really feel the need to um, keep taking it. Yeah, keep All taking right. it. But I did apply the arnica gel. Okay, good. We should take a look down here. Okay. It's still a little swollen, but that's normal. Mm -hmm. The bruising is normal too. Um, but it looks good. Yeah. All right, perfect. It looks good. Um, so remember the garment. You only have to wear that for a week. Okay. Um, completely like 24 7 mm -hmm. after that first week you just kind of like if you're at home not doing anything you could just keep it on okay. you need to step out for whatever reason you don't have to uh, right. keep it on um i'm going to give you this this is just a scar treatment um so hopefully this will diminish the look of the scar okay, okay. it's a really tiny incision it's anyways here, right? yeah okay. um so you put this on once the incision um closes up and it scabs up once the scab falls off on its own that's when you can start applying this okay okay so it's still open right now yeah, it's still a little open right now, okay. um, but it's fine. Okay. Yeah. And then the bruising will go down like the second week or? About maybe. It just depends on how your body heals. Okay. Um, some might take a little bit longer. Um, but yeah, like about two weeks. Just keep applying the Arnica gel and then the pills too. Okay. Right? Did you get the pills or yeah, was just the? Yeah, I have the pills. Yeah? But okay. The antibiotics, I finished them already. You don't know what I mean. It was just four. Yeah. yeah. Um, do you have any questions for me? No. no. no? Okay, good. Um, Alrighty, so I'm going to go ahead and grab Dr. Doss. He's going to come in and take a look, okay? okay Thank you. You're welcome. Hi, doctor. How are you doing? Good, good. And yourself? Not too bad. Did you take any pain medicine? Um, I did. A little, just like one or two. Okay. I already took them when I, need, when I felt the need to. I stopped taking them already because I don't really feel that much pain anymore. This looks great. It looks really good. Nice. Yeah, it's like super, like, just tight. Yeah. Yeah, good. Smile a little bit for me. Okay, good. Perfect. Yeah, everything's doing good. This is normal bruising for this yeah. early. It's only been 30 days, right? Yeah. It's your bit early, so. So just keep using the um, Arnica. Okay. And that'll help with the bruising. And keep using this guy. When you're at one week, remember, then you can reduce it down to just when you're not in public. Okay. And also when you're at a week, you can start massaging this area. Okay, perfect. Right. So either with your fingers or your thumb. Oh, okay. once, once the, okay. at, at about a week, yeah. Okay. Okay. Perfect. Thank yeah. you. I yeah. know I love it. I love it looks so good. It really does. Yeah, awesome. It made a huge difference. Yeah, already. And it's only yeah. been, what, four days? Uh, yeah. yeah. And it's still swollen, so. Still swollen. Yeah, yeah. so why don't we see you back in, I don't know, maybe about a month or so? Okay. A month or so? And we'll take a look at things. And that's perfect. when we'll really get an idea. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Any questions for me? I can stop taking the pain medication, correct? Oh, yeah. Yeah, it's only there if you need it. Okay. Most people don't need it or just take like one or two when they're done. Right. We okay. just give it to you just in case. Okay. Yeah. Thank okay. you so much. Okay, no problem. <laughs> All right, guys, so now that he's gone, we're going to put this back on. Back to my wibble head. So it is currently day seven, I'm a week in, and today's actually November 9th, so I'm pretty sure the video is going live today. I just wanted to update you guys. I still have a little bit of bruising 
it did go down a little but i'm just hoping that by the next week i'm gonna be like completely healed hopefully if i keep putting on the arnica gel i love my results i'll put like a before and after right here so you guys are able to see like really see the difference and this picture was just only after my second day dude literally when i took it off that's when i took the picture and i was like ah. so the fact that it's still swollen and it looks that good i'm just like shook i will be leaving all of dennis Death's information in the description down below honestly i had such a great experience with him 10 out of 10 and i just can't wait to see my full results and of course i'll be keeping you guys updated as the days go by on how it's healing how it's looking but i'm very excited super happy i did this guys if you guys enjoyed this video and liked seeing my whole process then do not forget to like comment share and subscribe and i'll see you guys in my next video besties bye